technology is constantly going through evolution and so are the languages that are used to develop them. There are so many languages today that a beginner would find himself lost when deciding what to learn. Fret not because by the end of this video, I'm sure you will know which language you need to target and master. Hi guys, my name is Arya and today we are going to go through the top 10 programming languages of 2019. At number 10, we have Kotlin. Kotlin, the Google endorsed programming language for building Android apps, now has become the most beloved programming language amongst developers according to a Stack Overflow survey. It's a statically typed programming language that runs on the JVM. Popular frameworks that use Kotlin are Ktor, Spring, and Vertex. The features that Kotlin comes powered with includes interoperability with Java, Android Studio support, and many others that allow you to write less code with fewer bugs. According to GitHub, the number of contributors using Kotlin to build projects has more than doubled in the past year, making it the most fastest growing language. The highlight of Kotlin is that it is being considered the one-stop language for application development. There are too many companies using Kotlin to list, but some more visible companies that have publicly declared usage of Kotlin include Square, Pinterest, and Basecamp. As of December 18, 2018, the average annual pay for a Kotlin developer in the United States is around $131,000 a year. Moving forward at number nine, we have Scala. Now Scala stands for Scalable Language and is one of the many attempts to rewrite Java while improving its drawbacks. It's a high-level programming language which incorporates functional programming and object-oriented programming into a powerful language. Scala's tech stack consists of diverse libraries, tools, and frameworks. Popular frameworks include Play, Aka and Apache Spark. Scala's attempt to make Java more functional by offering advanced features like string comparison advancements, pattern matching and mixing, and Scala's complex features promote better coding and offer a performance increase. The language is versatile, allowing it to be used in software development, web apps, and mobile solutions, with game development being the highlight. Scala is already a success given the fact that big companies like Apple, LinkedIn, Twitter, and The Guardian use it in their code base. Being one of the booming technologies in the present, Scala developers are paid with an average salary of around $117,000 a year. Next up on our list is one of the oldies, and that is C++. C++ is a simple yet powerful programming language that provides a structured approach. It is one of the most popular language from which developers usually start their programming journey. It is an object-oriented language which is rich with a set of library functions and data types. Using C++, you can develop the most reliable software and the major domains in which C++ is used mostly are game development, scripting, mobile applications, and web solutions. Major highlights of C++ applications are like Adobe Photoshop, Google Chromium, MapReduce, Mozilla Firefox, MySQL Database, and operating systems from Apple and Microsoft are also developed using C++. C++ provides a generic framework and libraries like WX Widgets, GTK++, Boost, Qt, etc. Talking about C++ jobs, various companies like Nvidia, Google, Microsoft, Apple hire skilled C++ developers, architects, designers, offering an average salary of $116,000 a year. Not only this, it is backed up with a huge community with around 436,000 GitHub repositories. Next up on our list is C Sharp. Now C Sharp is a simple object-oriented programming language with a rich set of libraries, which makes the compilation and execution of C Sharp lightning fast. C Sharp is mostly used with Microsoft's .NET framework to design web forms, Windows applications, etc. It is popularly known for game development, especially Xbox, using Microsoft's XNA framework. Also, it is used alongside languages like ASP in web development, and C Sharp is an important part of virtual reality games, and it is popularly known for developing Windows 8 and Windows 10 applications. It is also used along with the Unity 3D game engine for game development. C Sharp uses frameworks like Xamarin and .NET for building mobile applications and game development. With over 436,000 GitHub repositories and an average salary of around $78,000 a year, and a high demand in companies like Cyber Infrastructure Inc., Daffodil Software, Intellect Soft, etc., C Sharp is one of the most advanced programming languages in today's world. Up next is a language that has recently started making headlines and also known as Golang. Now, developed by the tech giant Google itself, Golang boasts features like concurrency that are hard to come by in other languages. Google's versatility as a company is reflected in the language they develop too. 
It can be used in a bunch of different scenarios, be it machine learning or web development. But the highlight is definitely system development due to Golang's scope of high scalability. Even though Golang got popular in recent times, it has some really useful frameworks like Revel and Bego in its backpack. Golang developers are in high demand and in low supply, which makes 2019 a fantastic time to learn Golang and add it to your resume so that you can apply to companies like Cisco, Tech Systems, etc., that offer a handsome salaries that go up to $120,000 a year. Above that, Golang has a budding community with around 80K repositories on GitHub itself. Moving on with our list is Swift. This object oriented block structured programming language had to make it to the list. It boasts of features like better readability, speed, and dynamic libraries. These features ensure lesser errors, reduce application size, and improve performance. Swift is specifically developed for application development. Apple switched to Swift from Objective C, hence, it is influencing Mac OS. WatchOS and Apple app development, which is its major highlight. Swift has two major frameworks, namely Cocoa and Cocoa Touch, which are centered around application development. With application development at its core, companies like Apple, Walmart, Amazon hire skilled Swift employees, and it has around 11,000 repositories with roughly 64,000 pushes, suggesting more than five pushes per repository on an average. A Swift developer earns around $81,000 a year on an average, summing up to its popularity and demand. Next up on our list is a language that has been universally accepted as a language of data scientists, which is R. Now developed by Ross Ihaka and Robert Gentleman at the University of Auckland, R is the most popular programming language for statistical analysis and data science. This language is not only open source, but also comes with cross-platform compatibility and huge community. With such features, R is used in the financial domain to build econometric models and analyze fraudulent transactions. It is also used in telecom sectors for churn management, subscriber profiling, and personalized advertising. The highlights of the language includes its ability to create interactive web apps and providing comprehensive library with 10,000 plus packages to cater diverse needs. The most popular IDE used for R is R Studio, and with R language as a skill set, you can become a data analyst data scientist, quantitative analyst, and financial analyst. The companies hiring for these positions are Facebook, Google, Twitter, offering an average salary of around $90,000 a year and have around 4 million Git repositories till date. Moving into our top three of the list is the tech giant Java. Now Java is currently the most popular language when it comes to the number of jobs, developers community, and widespread acceptance in the IT industry. It is open source and relatively easy to learn. Java prides itself in its powerful features, which include strong memory management, high performance, backwards compatibility, and a top-notch security, just to name a few. Java finds itself being used in a multitude of domains, including mobile application, web development, system programming. But its highlight is the ability to make small modules or applets for applications. Java is also the base of a number of popular frameworks like Spring, Hibernate, and Strut, just to name a few. On the topic of job trends, Java developers find their demand in both public and private sectors, regardless of the size of the company, with a median salary of $97,000 per year. Above that, Java has fantastic community support with above 900,000 repositories on GitHub itself. Up next is one of my personal favorite language, JavaScript. Universally known as the language of web developers, JavaScript is a feature-rich object-based scripting language. Featuring asynchronous event handling and crisp syntax, JavaScript has found widespread use in the field of web development. What started off as a simple client-side scripting language is now a highlight within the web development community, featuring multiple frameworks for both backend and front-end development. Having JavaScript on your resume opens up numerous doors filled with opportunities for you. Whether it be some small startup or tech giants like Google and Facebook, Everybody needs an employee who knows web development and they get paid well too. With the median salary of JavaScript developers being around $110,000 a year, according to Indeed.com. Above that, JavaScript boasts a robust community featuring more than 400,000 JavaScript based repositories on GitHub itself. And the last language on our list is obviously Python. Now, Python is an open source object oriented interpreted language which provides support for developing graphical user interfaces. These GUIs are used to create 2D imaging softwares like Inkscape, PaintShop Pro, etc. Web frameworks including Django, Flask, and web applications like Google App Engine are based on Python. 
Ubuntu's Ubiquiti installer and Fedora's Anaconda installer are also written in Python. Reddit, which was originally written in common lips, was later written in Python. Python is a user-friendly general purpose language that can be easily integrated with C, C++, and it also provides cross-browser support. Popular Python frameworks include Django, Pyramid, TurboGear, and Web2Pi. With over 894,000 GitHub repositories and an average salary of around $116,000 a year, and a high demand in companies like Google, Facebook, Instagram, Spotify, etc., it is no wonder that Python was voted the most wanted technology of the year. Okay, guys, that brings us to the end of this list of top 10 programming languages of 2019. If you have a different list than ours, please post them down in the comment section below. Until then, it's goodbye. I hope you have enjoyed listening to this video. Please be kind enough to like it and you can comment any of your doubts and queries and we will reply them at the earliest. Do look out for more videos in our playlist and subscribe to Edureka channel to learn more. Happy learning!